So today's event is a demo style showcasing the latest marketing tools for nonprofits. So next up, we have Ava Taylor, Director of Social Impact at Hootsuite. Ava has over 12 years of experience creating and executing strategic programs and campaigns that connect and engage brands and employees with their customers, communities, and other stakeholders. In her role as Director of Social Impact, Ava creates initiatives to empower its employees to give back to the communities where we live and work, including the award-winning Hootsuite for Good program. Ava also works closely with nonprofit organizations to harness the power of social good. So today we'll see how you can market your mission on social media with Hootsuite. Social media plays a critical role in helping nonprofit organizations provide accessible information, deliver help when it's needed, and inspire people to take action on the causes they care about. However, we don't always know if our social media efforts are giving us the results that we need. So during this five minute demo, we'll be focused on performance and how to get the most out of your social media efforts using the best time to publish feature, sentiment reporting, and report scheduling. Thanks for joining us today, Ava. Thank you so much for having me. It's lovely to see everyone here and so engaged in the conversation as well. Um, so yeah, we, uh, as mentioned, I work for Hootsuite and we are the global leading social media management platform. So as many of us are on many platforms, this really is the one tool you need to bring everything together into one place. And you know, we do have several programs that fall under social impact at Hootsuite being a global company. Um, the one I do want to focus on today is specifically our Hoot Giving program, which is specifically designed for nonprofits such as yours. And through this Hoot Giving program, it gives nonprofits up to 75% off our, our team and pro plans, which is our dashboards and our tools. Uh, it, we also have an incredible database of education. So a lot of certifications and courses to help you to, to have that leading edge in social media. It's a very complex, changing landscape. We we can see things happening all the time on the different networks and, and our academy is proud to be updating their content regularly to keep up with the changes. So we do encourage nonprofits to reach out and request a discount, which can be found on our website. And um, we, we're used by thousands of nonprofits now, and I'm going to show you just a few of the features as to why we are here to help and how we're helping. Um, you know, I think what's really important to consider is that, you know, in multiple reports, we see email and social media remaining the top two ways that donors worldwide are inspired to give by. So we really can't afford to not be on social and you can't afford to not keep building that email list and then bring those together as we've seen in so many of the tools today in our different demos. Um, so from a problem perspective, um, we know that social media is quite critical in helping organizations of all kinds, including nonprofits, getting inc important information out at the right time to the right people and inspiring those people to take action. We've had a number of nonprofits recently just reach out and just express how helpful it's been to have a dashboard like Hootsuite where they can bring in their volunteers in times of crisis, like a hurricane hits and life-saving information needs to get out to the right people in the right channels. And that's what we're here to help with. Uh, but, you know, as mentioned in many of the other presentations, we all face limited time challenges, resources, competing priorities. And so I want to talk a bit about how we can help with those particular challenges. So these are just a few of the ways that we hear nonprofits really valuing the tool that we have. And so uh, from you know a dashboard perspective, the way that you can co coordinate your communications and get the information out to the right people, build those communities, you know, we're really focused on first and foremost, freeing up time for your team. And your team could be a team of one. It could be a few people with different hats on. It could be volunteers. Our level of permissions make it really easy to have that, that security that you might need as an organization. And then we really want to help simplify those tasks, make it super easy to get content inspiration, figure out what's working best, repurpose content, and um, connect to all the apps that you might already be using. Um, whether it's image editing, for example, um, e-commerce compliance, et cetera, we have an enormous ecosystem to make it like just a click away. And then you can also take it on the go, on the go with mobile apps. And uh, Academy, as mentioned, is just how do you build up those skills? How do you add value for the volunteers that you have? How do they contribute to your strategy and help you be even more effective and quick with your time? So in a quick demo, um, one of the features I love talking about that's actually really simple and maybe overlooked is the best time to publish. So one thing you don't want to do is spend a lot of time figuring out what day am I going to send this out? What time of day um, and for networks? So this is a tool that we have under analytics. So on the left-hand side, you can kind of see the numbered order there. But if you click into best time to publish and you pick the network that you want to focus on, you actually have your choice of goals, as you can see under the four. So 
if you want to extend reach and capture attention, we're going to show you which times of day you should post when your audience is online and interacting. And it's also set to the time zones that you're based in, based on your account. If you wanted to build awareness, you can choose that objective to get more eyes on your content at the right times. And that heat map is going to change and adjust to that particular goal. Increasing engagement is helpful if you're focused on building an engaged community. And if you have Facebook as well, you can actually select increased traffic and revenue, and you can use those links in your post to drive those alternate organizational goals that you might have. You have the ability to, when with the time shown, like click one click to say schedule for this time. And our compose is going to fill in all the details for you for that network, that time and day. And then it's just literally creating the content. So, you know, putting in your copy, creating the link. We have integrations right in our composer for things like Canva and Grammarly just to make it super simple. And then you can hit schedule. I do want to quickly show we also have quite a new tab called content inspiration and this is kind of cool because depending on the type of content that you want to you know the category you can then just pick that theme and it's really quick and easy to adapt as a template and you know with social media in general I think regardless of the type of industry that you're in emotion and the way that people feel about your content the value you add is really what will help set you apart so do you teach people something do you make them feel something it could be humor it could be um more of like a, you know a sad kind of thing it could be the fear of missing out like these these emotions are really powerful when it comes to storytelling on social media which is absolutely critical to engaging people and having them take notice of your content so if you're spending the time to put it out there we do want to make sure that you're you're hitting the best kinds of emotions and getting the kinds of reactions that you want from people. So for example, if we were to pick the, the one highlighted here, you can pick an example piece of content from us and then you can just tweak it for your organization. It's, it's really simple and easy to do that. And then you can schedule across your, your channels and you can get a visual representation of your calendar, drag things around and, and adjust. And uh, it's just really simple. So those are just a two of the features that I know are, are helpful in terms of saving time. Um, there's so much more around analytics and automation I'd love to get into, but we would love to help your organization with social. Please do check out our website to find out more information about our Hoot Giving program or reach out to me anytime if you have questions. And then my sneak tip is if you ever reach out to Hootsuite on social at Hootsuite, for example, on Twitter and Instagram. The social team is looking at every single message. It's kind of a shortcut if you want to skip the support team and get advice. That's the secret tip I like to give out in just these kinds of sessions. And uh, thank you so much for your time. 